Welcome to another Camping Survival video blog. My name is Tom Shaka. We get a lot of questions about water purification, people traveling, people going overseas. You know, what's the best water filter? And there's, there's really no solid answer. I like to go with a process, and I'll explain the process as a last ditch resort. I mean, I spend a lot of time in the woods and on the water, and I like to have water filters on me, and that's the simplest way to go. Now, water filters, 99.999%, um, they get almost everything out. I've trusted them many times. But uh, depending on your situation, the only 100% way to kill everything in water is to boil it by 10 minutes or more. Um, now, the problem with that is, depending on your water source, and again, I, I'll ask people, you know, what's your water source? Where are you going? What's the water like? Let's say you don't know what's upriver. Killing everything in water is good, but what about chemicals? You can't kill chemicals. So that's why I like, I like a, a, a tiered process of, of water treatment. And again, that said, it's probably overkill what I'm going to explain, and I don't do that, but I like to give people information. I, I guess I'm taking a little chance by going with just a water filter. I mean, the ultimate way, let, let's say maybe for long-term preparedness and survival, that type of thing, and you have questionable water, I would initially, I mean, if you look at this water, it's kind of cloudy and murky. There's going to be a bunch of this nasty stuff in here. Um, it's nice if you have the ability with coffee filters or maybe clean clothing or cloth is to pre-filter the water to get all the stuff out of it. Then I would kill everything in the water. Now, you can use water purification tablets. They're great for being portable, chlorflock. We, have, we sell different types of water purification tablets, but also, just FYI, um, 16 drops of uh, bleach, unscented and nothing special about it, just basic chlorine bleach, 16 drops per gallon will kill everything in the water. Now, it's going to taste bleachy, as will water purification tablets. It's going to make it taste funny, either iodine-based or chlorine-based. It's up to you. Now, so let's say you use your water purification, you pre-filter it with a cloth, Use your water purification tablets or your, you know, household bleach. Kill everything in the water. Now you want to get the chemicals out, so you're going to want to filter it. We have those great countertop aqua rain and Katadin water filters. You just pour water in the top, and it comes out clean in the bottom. Again, it's only 99.9999 or something to that. So you might even want to, again, as I said, pre-treat it with chlorine, that type of thing. Now. We also have the, the, you know, the life straws, the life straw families, that type of thing. Those are good filters. But again, depending on the filter, and if it doesn't have a charcoal element, it's still going to leave some flavor. And whatever you treated it with, the, the water purification tablets or the bleach, and even the water source is going to have a flavor to it. So if you get a filter, such as some of our Catadins and our Aqua Rains, that has charcoal built into it, that's a great idea too. But another way, if you don't do that, let's say you just have, you know, say the Life Straw Family or the Life Straw Go. Um, I just had that. Here it is right here, Life Straw Go. Um, another way to finish off your water is one of those Brita pitchers. They have the charcoal. That changes the flavor of the water. So, do you want to do overkill? That's up to you. Or do you just want to filter it or use water purification tablets? Any one of these ways will work. But, uh, None of them, even boiling, because that can't get rid of chemicals, is going to be 100%. So, it may be overkill, but just for information's sake, I wanted to give you that, that tiered system. Cloth, kill everything in the water with tabs or um, boiling, and then filter with a high-quality filter, and then uh, some kind of a charcoal element to, to clean the, the, the taste in the water out. So just some information for you folks, and uh, improvise, and improvise, adapt, and overcome is what I like to say. That, you know, apply that to everything. Thank you, and have a nice day.